and took care of it. Alvarez, I mean. Thanks, brother. She'd do this here for us. Yeah, she would have. inside that mobile medical unit. Oh, God damn it. Fuse blown. Feels, yes.
should be it. <laughs> now we're in business. I'll let you do it. Another infestation zone. Crossing. Wow, that's not too smart even without the traffic. <coughs> I gotta burn him out. I gotta make it safer to ride. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later. Tucker, Alki. Over at the dig site. Well, which one, goddammit? The north one. Back there. If anybody touches this bike or anything on it, I break your fingers. Whatever, man. Jesus. I'm telling you, everywhere you look, it's all one giant lava field. 25 feet solid rock. It'll take jackhammers to. I don't need a lecture, goddammit. I get it. No, you don't. But these people are hungry, even if they had all their strength. It'll take them months to finish this job with picks and shovels. I don't give a shit!
We're all hungry, Al. But this job's got to get done, whether it takes all goddamn year. It's not like we got somewhere else to be now, do we? Wait. Not finished. We'll make it quick, will you, Al? I got things to do. Rippers, this morning, one of my men spotted a large group of them coming over the pass. And no one stopped them? How the f... Tucker, you know we're already spread thin. Are, are they headed north? Al, are they headed towards us? Yes or no? I... I don't know. Maybe he knows. <laughs> what the fuck are you up oh. to now, huh? What's this about, huh? Damn it, Al Kai. It's not his job to know. It's your goddamn job to know. I can't be at two places at one time. You either want me here, running your dig, or you want me out there in the shit, chasing the rippers. Go check the store, see how much ammo we got left. I'll tell Wheeler to watch the dig. What are you looking at? I don't know, I'm just waiting for you to smarten the fuck up. Don't! Did you track down Leon? Good thing someone around here knows how to make things happen. Ride with me. How long has it been since you found someone, brought him in? The kind of people left out in the shit aren't the kind of people you want me bringing in. We lost two more to the fever. It's not my problem. You want our food? I'm making it your problem. I told you we'll do runs for you, but we're not joining your goddamn camp. Remind me again, my old woman's memory. Why is that? <laughs> because it's a waste of time, Tuck. Well, aren't you the optimist? Where's Boozer? He said he was gonna head over to Copeland's camp, see about trading for some fish. You're not in bed with Cope now, are you? His camp near yours? It's not closer or further. Look, I'm not Boozer's old lady. He goes where he wants. <laughs> Jesus. You keep the shit burning all day and night. Got a lot of freak corpses piling up out here. With men like you doing your jobs, damn right we keep it burning. Try using more gasoline. It burns faster, less fumes. Like we got so much to spare? When it's all gone, what are you gonna put in that bike of yours, spit and sweat? Now what the hell is going on here? The count's off. Storage is missing food and some ammo. Jesus. Who was on watch last night? Wheeler. Tonight, double the watch. This shit's starting to piss me off. You got it. Trouble in paradise. It's like I was saying. Camp's like a prison. Bunch of goddamn lazy liars, thieves, rapists, and murderers. You know why that is? No idea. Because that's who we are. The freak show. Only folks survived were those mean enough, nasty enough to out-freak the freaks. The rest are here. Hoping I feed them, protect them, keep them nice and cozy and warm so they can sit on their asses and watch the world end. You! Get your ass back to work! Don't make me go get Cyrus. Lazy sons of bitches can screw around all they like on their time. Daytime is my time. Running this camp is no different than running a prison. I can't remember what you said. You were, you were what? You were a warden or something? <laughs> Nothing so high and mighty. I was matron of the women's ward. Like you look like the sort who might have spent some time in the pen back in the day. You ever do time? I had my share of trouble, but I never landed in K-State. I got a job for you. Larson was on a run yesterday. Passed through Marion Fork, said he saw someone. Young woman looked like, but he only caught a glance. He stopped to look around, but he never found her. Is he sure? Larson's been doing this long as you. He knows a person from a freak. But you got a knack for this. You head over there and find her before the freaks do. I'll see what I can do, but look, I want the rest of my credits for Leon. Work. You bring me work. warm bodies, I'll give you all the credits you can spend. I gotta go find Wheeler. Someone's looking at a night in the shack. Alkai. What do you want, Drifter? What's your problem? Hmm? One of my men, a 
escaped a ripper camp over by Iron Butte. Got tortured, like they always do. But this time, they kept asking me if he knew about it. Two bikers, two men, asking me if he'd ever seen them or heard of them. A lot of bikes around here. What's it, <laughs> what's it got to do with me? The Ripper called them mongrels. How many drifters still flying colors around here? As if that shit matters. You ask me, you got a price on your head. How's it feel to be on the other side? Yeah, why don't you just show me what you got because I don't have time for your bullshit. Whatever you say, Deacon. What else can I do for you? Good choice. Thanks. Can I get anything else for you? Yeah, all right. I'll be here. What? I just gotta figure out who I'm gonna give this to. We can't head north until I get this bike fixed up. Copeland it is. Bet you're here for your, your bike, right? It's Deacon! I've seen everything you've done for the camp. A lot of folks alive because of you. What do you need? Okay, man. All right, see you, Deacon. Working at the Good to see you, Deacon. Hey. Hey, Cope. I think Leon was bringing you this. Oh, Deacon. <laughs> You made a wise choice. A wise choice. Uh, you go see Manny. Maybe he can help you with that bike of yours. <laughs> hey, Deke, how's it going? Man? Hey, you, Manny. Deacon, my man! Manny? <laughs> it is new. I'll be here. Don't be a stranger. Manny, camper's life, right? Deke, you there? Boozer, why the hell aren't you in your damn bunk? I couldn't sleep. You, you remember what I said back in the tunnel? Don't go up there, Deke. It's it's making you crazy. Boozer, I... Okay, look. I go up there because there's freaks up there. I kill them here, I kill them there. Bounties are all the same to me. Then what are the tulips for, huh? I saw them, Deke. 
here on the table this morning. The same one she had at the wedding. I remember. I'm not gonna... Listen, Boozer, get some rest. I gotta go. Deacon out. And I'm on Tulip's Boozer. There's stone crop. Get it right. Hey, okay. I'll see if I can make time. Deacon out. Hang on. You're not gonna make it out here. I know where there's a camp. What? what? Camp? There's a camp? Where? Where? Show me. I'll go. Go toward Three Finger Jack, find the Salome Hot Springs, talk to Alki Turner. He'll help you out. Oh, man. Thank you. Thank you. I was done for. Holy shit! I was, I was a goner, you know? Whew! Thank you so much, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, let them know it was Deacon St. John. They know me. Keep your head down and run. What can I get for you? What do you want? Deke, you ever ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. 
Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, talk, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman to death. Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt, oh, Maria, right? Oh, Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yep, I know where it is, and, uh, I'll handle it. I thought you might. Bet you're here for your bike, right? I got this. Hey! Look, I'm here, and yeah, looks like Limbo and his crew are calling the place home like nothing ever. Uh, he said his face was scarred, so, uh, I mean, more, please? What else can you tell me? He wears a green coat. Looks like a goddamn leprechaun. You bring me his tire iron, Deacon St. John, and I want him covered in what's left of the son He's of a bitch's face. Now I hear you. Uh, St. John out.
incoming! Got old iron tooth on you, yeah?
you want. You find that son of a bitch? Yeah, here's old Iron Tooth, just like you asked. Ah, uh, nice work. Deke, you're always the one person I could count on to get things done. <laughs> you know, I have no idea where you and Boozer rode off to, but it's good to see you. Well, we're around, Tuck, and if you need anything, you know how to reach me. Go see Alki. I'll update your credits. Yeah? I can fix this. That should do it. 